This is the Zero's Tolerance 620. And in here is the carbon fiber version, which I'm now regretting selling. But we're gonna do this review anyways. Tears or no tears. Hey everybody, this is the Zero Tolerance 620 carbon fiber, the Emerson Tanto. Now, this knife has been discontinued, so I'm not going to spend a lot of time reviewing it. Just enough to say, hey, if you see one on the secondary market, should you get one? Or should Blade HQ find another secret batch of them? Should you jump on it? The answer to that right up front is yes. This knife is amazing. I love the this version of the knife. The LMAX version. And this is CTS 204P which as y'all know is 20 CV or M390 by a different name. So there you go. This thing is really something else. It seems like I need more light there. I would turn on the flash, but then it looks like I'm doing it from the planet of the planet. From the sun. The sun is not a planet and neither is the moon. So anyways, check this out. Check out that really cool Tanto grind on that. The satin blade with the stonewash kind of offset here. Look at this. I did sell this to a buddy, and so it's going out, and I wanted to get a quick review on it. You got one, two, three, about three and a half inches of that 204P, which it proudly tells you right there on the side. You check that out. All right, you got the carbon fiber. Oh my gosh. Let's see how much inches on the carbon fiber. This is gonna be a really quick review. I just wanted a chance to look at it with you guys before. One, two, three, four, four and three quarter inches. It snaps open like a dream and it, and it waves really nicely. Come, but the carbon fiber on this thing, just the way they milled it out and just made it all nice. I mean, this is a nice knife. This is a great knife. But the way they just fixed up, fixed it up with this thing, this is just a souped up version. Super nice. I like the bolt here, the way they changed up the pivot. I kind of like that. It, you know, you get tired of the, the whole Torx thing. So it's kind of different and kind of cool. It doesn't have a lanyard hole, but it does have a standoff here for the lanyard that you can go ahead and get your lanyard freak on. Get your freak on. Get your freak. Isn't an old song? Get your freak on. Or I just make it up. Am I a musical genius or I just have a good memory? You decide. Let me know in the comments. <laughs> All right. So there you go. It's got the wave thing. Like I said, it works out good. It's got the thumb, the thumb disc, the thumb disc. I think the thumb plate is a Demco thing. So the thumb disc. Open construction. Just a sturdy tank like knife. This is a super user. This is a, one of the most usury kind of knives that I've had from ZT. It's the kind that you want to stick in your pocket. Now, a lot of ZTs you get, they're really nice, really locked up, and they just seem like, man, I don't really want to use this thing. This thing wants to be used. Now, this one's too pretty to be used. However, this one here, this one wants to be used and will be used. All right, so check that out. The weight on this, I'm not going to bring out the scale because my camera's messed up. I'm not sure what's going to happen there, but I'm going to look at the website here and trust it to tell me the truth. That, oh, gosh. 6.2 ounces. This is a pretty hefty knife. I didn't realize how hefty it was. That's a, that's a lot of titanium and blade there. Check that out. Check the thickness of that blade out. I mean, wow. That's pretty awesome. All right, like I said, I'm just going to do a quick overview look at this thing. I'm not going to bring out a ton of stuff. It is discontinued. I did get it on a discontinued kind of rush sale that they did a couple months ago. And my buddy wanted it, and I wanted money. So it worked out really nicely between us. All right, if you get a chance to get one, it's. I mean, if you can find one of these and say... Like new condition, 180 bucks, 190 bucks, jump on it because I think these are going to be really tough to get pretty quick. 
And of course this one, oh my gosh, they keep finding new ones of these, but if you can find one of these for 140, 150, a super worker with that LMAX steel. I think that's all for now. Just checking it out before it takes a trip to the north. And let me know what you think. Do you have this knife? Do you like the Emerson stuff? You know, I'm not a huge, huge Emerson fan, but man, I like that they do with the ZT. All right, so let me know. Leave a comment down there. Like and subscribe if you get a chance. If you aren't subscribed, subscribe. Put the bell so you know when I'm doing my videos, which is a lot. There's a lot of them coming out. 900 and something so far. All right, I'll talk to you all later. All right, this is the ZT620. And in this box is this carbon fiber brother. Then I regret ready the ZT620. And in this box is the carbon fiber version that I'm regretting selling. <laughs> this is the ZT620. <laughs> this is the ZT620. And this box is the carbon fiber version, which I am now regretting selling. We'll do it in for you. This is the zero dollar six twenty.